Hi everyone, happy Friday. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com with 2019 Panini Diamond Kings Baseball 12 box pick your team number five from jazbeescasebreaks.com. There it is right there. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into it. On a Friday. Brian O. Last spot mojo and oppo Joe Mojo going oppo on that. All right, so let's pop this guy open and see which side we're going to do. All right, so we'll go one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. I'm gonna use this guy right here. Five. So one, two, three, four, five, six. We're gonna be doing this side right here. marks the spot. So that X, that's the side we're doing here. And right there is pick your team six. <laughs> yeah, I, I switched the die. All right. Die conspiracy there. Good luck, everybody. Now, this is a pretty long break, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see the schedule in the chat. But this is a perfect time for all of you honors football fans that just dropped today to fill up all of those spot randomizers. Then we'll do all the spot randomizers back to back to back. Then we'll do a pick your team. Then we'll do another spot randomizers, all three back to back to back. Then we'll do a pick your team. All of that is on jazbeescasebreaks.com. So hopefully we can get all that filled up by the time we get finished with this. Of course, honors football, as some of you older collectors may remember. <laughs> What's that infamous scam scammer breaker, the Brandon Cooks 99 scammer breaker? And Frankie kind of looks like he got into a little bit of a rabbit hole of the YouTube's, uh, YouTube videos of, of other scammers too. Yeah, it's a shame. Oh, it ruins it for everybody else who's trying to, trying to, you know, run an honest business, right? What if that was someone's first experience with the hobby and they're like, ah, terrible, you know, let's, not going to get back into collecting. It'll ruin it for people. But. Gilo, what's going on? Spreadsheet right here. This is a, especially since this is a longer break, this is a good time for everybody to make sure that you guys are watching live. Double check that. Sometimes you can be lagging behind or or get kicked back on the on the stream, so always give that a shot. Alright, so we'll breeze through these. 
obviously the, these short prints, 101 to 150 or something like that, or and up, will we'll all ship. Inserts like this frame, Christian Yelich will ship. And obviously the hits, obviously the rookie cards right here too. And there's Jake Cave. Five out of 99. Nice dual relic for the Twins. That's going to be for Jeremy Anderson and the Twinkies. Is it Cave? Any Minnesota fans here? Is it Cave or Cave? I feel like I've something in the back of my brain is saying it's Cave, but maybe I'm just outsmarting myself. There's Chris Davis, frame. So two hits per box, by the way. One relic. It's generally one relic and then one autograph. Vladimir Guerrero Jr., I think in his first, uh, oh, it's just straight up cave, Jeremy. I'm overthinking it. His kid, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., hit a home run. And like in his first appearance for his AAA team. I'll bet he's going to get called up pretty soon. Once he's 100%. Mike Mussina. Nice. Dual relic and autograph. That's Yankees edition. Nice, not numbered, huh? No, but still nice. Yankees. That goes to Jim Gray. All right, next box. Whoa! Axel, what's going on, man? Good, good. How are you? Good. What are you doing? Just visiting? Yeah, hanging out? I was on my popcorn. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, and I hit up Jason. I was like, yo. Yeah, hang out, dude. Yeah. And then welcome. Yeah. <laughs> All right, next box. Good luck. What do we got? Do we got, we got any final scores for you? No, I think there's only – the Twins-Tigers game was postponed due to inclement weather. I think the Angels-Cubs game is the only final. Cubs won 5-1. to one. Contreras hit two homers. Angels are without Mike Trout. I was on – I had some financial interest in the Angels, but very small financial interest. It would have been a little bit more if there was Trout in the lineup, but – all right, do we have some games in progress? We've got, well, my Dodgers are facing the Brew Crew tonight. Both teams got swept in their respective series, the series before, so someone's going to have to win tonight. Um, White Sox are leading the Yankees 7-5 to five in the middle of the fifth inning. Nationals are leading the Pirates by by a run, two to one. Rays are cruising against the Blue Jays, six to nothing. Ray, Blue Jays have only managed two hits. Vlad Guerrero Jr., we need you. All right, next box. Oh, Eloy Jimenez had had a two-run homer. Nice for the White Sox. Otani is supposed to come back. No, he won't be pitching this year. That I know. But he should be back to hitting, they're hoping, sometime in May, a few weeks. But 
but he will not be pitching this year. But next year he should be back to back to pitching duties. He can still hit this year though, which is which is good. I think when initially he went down and got the Tommy John. Ooh, nice Steven Duger. Twenty out of twenty five. That goes to Brian O and the Giants. Last spot mojo and Oppo Joe Mo no, I'm not wearing my Dodgers hat today. Oppo Joe Mojo. Nice he's getting some regular playing time with the Giants right now. But yeah, I think everyone was worried, you know, when he went down, there's everyone was like, "Oh no." You know, like hashtag #bad for the hobby, Atani being out for his entire second year, right? But he's still going to be hitting, so I think that's going to be great. There's a Yelich relic for Jonathan Best. Julio Urias will be facing Christian Yelich and the Brew Crew tonight. Should be an interesting. I gotta try to find a stream for that. It's Tuki Toussaint kind of had a rough start in Triple A. I'm hoping he gets called up. Got him on my minor league spot in my fantasy league. Gilo saying, Joe, usually I'm usually gaming during breaks. All right, yeah, a lot of people multitask. You watch a game on your iPad, and then Jaspi's on the phone. Whoa! Tonight, I'm on the iPad? Woo! Ooh! That is hot! I made it. I, I'm, I'm, I've been promoted to the iPad, folks. I'm happy about that. Thanks, Shilo. Moving up in the world. In your, 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 you, you have a lot of entertainment choices, ladies and gentlemen. I'm glad that, I'm glad that we're among them. Nice, Colton. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the Mariota one of one. Congrats, man. That's pretty strong. Jeremy Anderson says, I'm still on the phone for Jeremy Anderson. All right, that's fine. It's all good. Yeah, I can't, I can't expect everybody to devote every single waking moment when I'm on air, right? You know, you... Uh, Keep me on in the background. That's just like it's like a sports talk radio show. You just keep me on in the background. A lot of people do that. A lot of people are like, yeah, you just it's like radio, like sports talk radio. Just keep you on the background every once in a while. My ears will perk up. Be like, oh, last spot mojo. I'll be like, I'm gonna run to the computer, buy a spot, and then go do your thing. And I think that's that's how a lot of a lot of you consume Jaspies, consume Jaspies content in that way. There you go, Jeremy. Falls asleep with the headphones on, listening to Jaspies. The soothing shuffle and crinkle of cards. There's Chance Adams for the Yankees. That goes to Jim Gray and the Bronx Bombers. There's Wade Boggs. Everyone knows the Wade Boggs story. Everyone, this is not, we are, we pride ourselves on being a family-friendly show, but I definitely enjoy a non-family-friendly show like uh, It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. And they've got a great Wade Boggs episode. There's Michael Brantley, Diamond Deco. Still Indians edition here. That'll go to Paul Hutchins. I can't believe that. I can't believe that he that the Astros picked him up. What a sneaky good pick. If he's healthy, he's gonna rake. Rake, I tell you. Dennis Santana. Might see him in action tonight. Chris Bryant. Oh, the Islanders just tied it up. 
Blake Snell. Verlander. And the Babe. Babe Ruth. All right, next box. Jay, what's going on? Jay Tinney saying, Joe, an update on your 2015 Spectra Football Master Set. 12 cards and includes all variations. Well, how close are you? Are you done? All right, next one. Uh, more scores. Red Sox leading the Orioles 3 to 2 in the top of the seventh. Phillies currently shutting out the Marlins six to nothing. Six inning just wrapped up, and Mets are six one currently leading over the Braves in Atlanta. Kyle Wright was on the mound today against Zach Wheeler. Rangers have an early two to one lead in the bottom of the third against the A's. Royals jumped out to a six one lead. It's only the bottom of the second there. And then late games tonight, Padres are at uh, in Arizona, Astros are in Seattle, uh, Colorado's in San Francisco, Tigers are in Min Oh, no, that game was postponed. And, uh, and the big one for me, and some of the crew here, some of our Wisconsin fans, Wisconsin Jaspi fans are also Brewers fans. Brewers here in L.A. Corbin Burns on the bump against youngster Julio Urias. It's a beautiful 71 degrees at Dodger Stadium right now. 71 and sunny. Oh, only 12 cards left. Wow, you're including signatures and RPAs in there too? I gotta... Jay, you gotta email us a picture of this. Jaspie's case breaks at gmail.com, our customer service email. I wanna take a... I'd like to see that. That's pretty awesome. All right, there's Garrett Hampson leading us off. And there's Colby Allard. Dual relic and autograph for the Bravos. That goes to TJ and the Braves. Ooh, 36 bombies, says Brian O. In the uh, Milwaukee area. How do you guys do that? 36 is like an overnight low during a particularly cold winter. Christian Yelich, Bat Kings. Nice, to 25. It's a, it's a thick card right there. That goes to the Brew Crew. Jonathan Best with the Brewers. What does everyone think? Can Christian Yelich repeat as NL MVP? The last NL player to do it was uh, Albert Pujols, I think when he was with the Cardinals. These Heirs of the Throne cards will be randomized front and back at the end of the break. I'll try to leave it here. I'll try to remember, unlike last time. It's Arenado. Gilo saying, can we call Yelich relics? Yelichs? Yes. I like that. I think we'll call them Yelichs. Now I want to pull more Yelichs. Tuve frame and Al Kaline at the end. Next box. Oh, you got them all in. I mean, like maybe like a, just a couple pictures, Jay, just to get an example of how you're storing them and 
just to get an idea of the scope of your project, I think would be pretty awesome. Oh, Brian, you live about three minutes away from Miller Park? That's pretty cool. Question for you. Uh, question for you. Can you, can, can, can civilians go down that slide? Uh, that's the big slide you guys have all the way in the outfield. Five dollar Uber ride, that's nothing. It's awesome. Trick question, Joe. Yes and no. Like, pretty much, if I go and visit there, I want to go down that slide. How do I do that? How can a regular old Joe like me do that? Only on home. I mean, I don't know. What it, like, like when there's not a game going on or before the game. I see no civilians can go down the, so no regular Joes can actually go down the slide at Miller Park. That's a missed opportunity. If they charge like 10 bucks a pop, I'd do it. I'd pay 10 bucks to go down there. Get drunk and make a run for it? I'd do it. Yeah, screw going onto the field. I'm running up to the slide. But, says Brian, you can take a tour at the lakefront brewery and slide down the slide that was at County Stadium and get a beer at the bottom. It's the same slide. Interesting. All right. So, but that's not, that's not like being, it's not like going down the slide at the actual ballpark, at Miller, current Miller Park, though. Out of 99, there's Reese McGuire, dual relic, 41 out of 99 for the Blue Jays. That's going to go to... Jim Gray and the Blue Jays. G Lo says people jump in the fountains in KC. It's free, but you'll get banned. I'd want to jump in that fountain. Now, this is also a front-back randomizer. Glaber Torres autograph. Look at that. 37 out of 49. Jim Gray and the Yankees. Nice. Nice. Next box. Brian O says, someone tried climbing up to the slide about five years ago. Didn't turn out well for that chap. Well, what, are they, what, are they, what, are they, what happens? You could just get arrested, you get banned from the stadium maybe? Or did they like tase him? Craig O says we smoke, we smoke bud at A's games. It's legal in California. It happens everywhere. In the parking lot, at Dodger Stadium. Oh, he fell. Oh, that's not good. I think they should make it pedestrian friendly. Pay ten bucks a pop. To go down that slide before and after games. That'd be awesome.
All right. Next box. Good luck. I think the Dodgers do a run the kids run the bases thing. Sundays maybe. Day games. There's a bring you bring your uh, bring your uh, pups to, pups at the park event. Have your dog run the bases. I want to do that one here. I hear it's I hear it's an S show though. No one would insure the slide because of the amount of Wisconsinite strength. Well, I don't know. Just make it, just put railings all over the place. All right, just it would be before games, then it would only be open before games, not after games. And we got Addison and Russell, Jersey and Otto. Cubbies, that's going to go to Joseph. L. Rand Wirt. J. E. W. J. Joseph E. Dubs. I like these cards. That, that design looks is pretty cool. There's your relic, Bat Kings, Willie Stargell, Pirates. It's gonna go to Michael Gallucci. I think I remember Michael saying that he works in an office downtown that may overlook. The stadium. I forget what it's called. Three River Stadium is what I'll call it. PNC. Blanked on that for a second. All right, folks, we've got... Six boxes to go, folks. We are halfway through this full case break. How are we doing on those spot randoms? I see nine orders coming in, so hopefully they're, they're spot random orders. Because we've got Pick Your Team 2 of the brand new honors. We've got Pick Your Team 2 and 3 sold out. We just need to finish off some spot randoms. We've got one spot random sold out, one at four. We've got to do some work on the other ones. We want to fill all of those up before we do any of the Pick Your Teams. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com, folks. Let's do it. Brand new release. Limited release. All right, back to back to the Diamond Kings. Oh, what, what games do I have financial interest in? I have financial interest in the Pirates. Are they going to help me out today? I don't think so. Game's still close, though. Top of the eighth. Top of the eighth. Nationals are only up by a run. Two to one. Pirates could still do it. Maybe some late, late, late inning heroics. Tampa Bay got financial interest in them. They are cruising. They are. They have still held the Blue Jays to just two hits. And they're in the bottom of the second. Cruising. <coughs> Excuse me. I also have the Marlins. I don't think the Marlins are doing well. Now the Marlins have down six to one. Phillies are up 6-1 to one in Miami. Thinking of maybe like home dog. Kind of take the home dog sometimes. That works. Joe Flores says, Did you know Joe Musgrove has a 0.0, .0 ERA at this point in the season? Joe Flores, yes. Because I have Joe Musgrove on my fantasy baseball team. So, yes. I'm happy about that. It was a nice start he had yesterday. All right. I do love seeing that because because uh, last few years I have just not been able to draft any pitching with any decency. I would always I don't know. I would always pick the wrong guys basically. So it's good that I'm finally that I finally got something right. There's Kristen Stewart. 
Tigers prospect, 77 out of 99. Nice one for Joseph. Joseph L. Rand, Wirt with that one. Grego says, hey, Joe, I think you should be able to take a shot of Wild Turkey 101 every time I ring the bell. I'd be okay with that as long as, Grego, if you're okay with me dropping that big one-of-one one hit and dinging in the corners of a $1,000 car, that should go to you. If that's all right, I'm down. I haven't watched sports since I left you. What do you mean you haven't watched sports since you left I barely found out Cody Bellinger. Bellinger yeah, he's raking right now. I'm a, I'm a Dodgers fan now. There you go. That's what I like to hear. I followed the hype. That, there you go. You know where the winners are. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then playoffs. I'm a Yankee. See what happens? <laughs> There's Frank Thomas, Jersey Kings, for the White Sox. Barry Swisher with the Shy Sox. You're okay with that, Grego? Yeah, okay, that's fine. I'm not sure if everyone else will be okay with that. I shorted that one. Shorted that one. All right, next one. Gilo's asking, so what's up with the Red Sox? They're doing awful, and you've got Mookie and Devers on my team. Well, I know. I have Mookie bets on my team, too. you got to think. You gotta think that uh, it can't be bad this long, right? Mookie Betts is like hitting like 240 something. That's not gonna last. He's gonna hit at least 40 points better. At least. Maybe even 50 points better. But do the, do the, next, the next one long distance? I don't know, this is precarious right now. I, I shorted that one, I shouldn't have done that. I, I have to overcompensate. And I have to try to get the next one a little bit further back so I can balance that out and then center it up. What's long distance? Like, am I taking three steps back? That's, that's two. I don't know if I could get it all the way there. Got to go off the screen. Oh, this this will just be like this will just be like warming up, like in baseball, right? We'll we'll start here. You know, maybe next time we'll take a step back and go there, take a step back, and the next you know we'll be long tossing. that one too. There's Josh James for the Astros. That goes to Paul Hutchins in the Strohs. Verlander, Francisco Lindor, do 
do we have Bozo the Clown out by me? In what context? Like, like showing up at parties and stuff? I don't really remember. I know, I know what a Bozo the Clown is. What about what about bedtime for Bonzo? Remember bedtime for Bonzo? Oh, it was a show. No, I don't remember the show. Do you remember? I remember uh, bedtime for Bonzo. That's what we had on when I was a kid. Never remembers that when they were kids, right? Watching bedtime for Bonzo. Oof, that's not good either. Well, it was much better yesterday. All right, four boxes to go. This one and then one, two, three. My other picks for tonight, I've got the... Uh, Games that have not started yet. I've got the Diamondbacks at plus 111. They are at home hosting the Padres. The Diamondbacks home dogs. A short home dog. I think I can go with that. Got my Dodgers hosting the Brewers. Brewers were swept by the Angels. Dodgers were swept by the Cardinals. Now they're facing each other. Someone's got to win. Julio Urias on the mound, going with that. I've also got Seattle as kind of heavier underdogs, plus 136 at home. They're, they're playing some hot baseball, and they're at home. I'm going I'm to go with that. I like Wade LeBlanc. I think he's got the start tonight. Rockies have to win at some point, right? Giants aren't very good. Rockies, plus 116. Road dogs, short road dogs. Going with that. Let's see how they do. All right. Oh, Stephen K remembers. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not into. I'm not into clowns as well. Paul Hutchins. Probably. I think I read the book It when I was way too young. On, on which, Greg? Grego. Bad Kings, Kirk Gibson. Tigers edition, Kirk Gibson. Steven Duger, another one for Brian O. And Oppo Joe Mojo. Giants. Gigantes. Three boxes to go, folks. Good luck. Um, 
I have read a lot of Stephen King, yeah. I haven't read like the, the trendy books. I've read It, Pet Cemetery, Salem's Lot, or others. I haven't, I, a couple of my buddies who are also Stephen King fans will always say, hey, you got you got to read uh, Watch Ta Dark Tower? Which I haven't gotten around to. The Shining was good. What's the one where he touches someone, goes, Zzz, and then sees how the sees how they die? There was an old Christopher Walken movie or sketch on him. Carrie is pretty good. I, I did not read the Langoliers. Dead Zone, right. There is Danny Jansen, dual relic and autograph for the Blue Jays. Jim Gray with the Blue Jays. People hop on a so Langolier, People hop on a plane, hit a wormhole to an alternate dimension. So Lost, it's like it's like the TV show Lost. Probably better. Probably better than Lost. speaker frame. Richard Bachman was his, what was whose pen name? Oh, Stephen King's pen name? That sounds like a character in one of his books. And we've got Alexander Rodriguez, Jersey Kings. A-Rod for the Yankees. That's going to go to Jim Gray with another one. Gray box. I read that short story book with, with, with like the Green Mile and Shawshank Redemption in it. That collection of short stories is pretty good too. All right, two boxes to go. Good luck, everybody. I see about 20 orders coming in. I want to fill up all the spot randoms before we get into, before we do any of them. So keep those going on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Nice. So one left in the Giants Bills spot random for pick your team two. This uh, Patriots Cardinals Saints spot random is sold out, and then we need to work on the Brown spot randomizer for pick your team two. Then we can do pick your team two. Jaspiescasebreaks.com. Get into it. Let's get it going. We're almost done with this break. Let's get the next one going. I think we're kind of right on schedule too. Breakfast there now? Dang. Okay, okay. Our local deli stepping up their game, ladies and gentlemen. All right. 
See, I got Jake Bowers at first, 0 for 2. DJ LeMahieu, 2 for 2. That's good. I need him to improve the average on my team here. And a couple RBIs and a run scored and a walk. Good job, DJ LeMahieu. Mookie bets over 3, but got me a stolen base, which I need. I need some of those, too. All right. Next two hits, what could they be? It's a downtown Matt Carpenter. Nice. He's generally fall one per case, and they're highly sought after. Who's got the Cardinals? The X-Line does. There you go. Ladies and gentlemen, in case you were wondering, if you've never been to uh, downtown St. Louis, that's exactly what it looks like. They have the World's Fair there. Ring, ring, ring goes the trolley. There's the arch. There, there's, they have a big Ferris wheel out there, apparently. Okay. And I guess just cardinals just roaming around. So that's what it looks like. Nice. Any guesses on this redemption for bragging rights? Wait, did I see in the chat earlier today? Um, did I see in the chat earlier today that someone, that some other like bad guy breaker was trying to scam someone out of a redemption? He claimed it was like a filler. Did I read that right? We were in the middle of a few things, so I didn't have a chance to respond to that. But it's like, come on, man. <laughs> Oof. That is dangerous right there. That is dangerous. Now we've got 77 out of 99 for the Phillies. And Yel De Los Santos. Yeah, look at that. Look at that, Stephen K. This is what happens in St. Louis. That looks kind of like an angry bird, though, doesn't it? More than a cardinal. So he looks at it, and then he pretends like it's... So he's just like, oh, that's just a... That's just a... That's just a filler. Can't do that, guy. Come on, man. Makes us all look bad. <laughs> Rich. <laughs> that got me. <laughs> Is that in reference to this? Uh, Brian O guessing a veteran of sort. That was dark, but funny. I'll go with uh, Brian O is going to guess uh, David Ortiz. <laughs> all right. That got me, Rich. <laughs> Rich is like, where's the murder? Dark. But you just that's a that's a window into my my sense of humor. <laughs> and Rich is apparently. This is why we get along, Rich. And and somewhat family friendly. And it's not wasn't just it wasn't like too too blatant, so it passes Jaspie's T V fourteen muster. Alright. The redemption is whoa, DK Signatures Hollow Gold Shohei Otani. It's showtime, showtime. Woo! That is for Elvis Ekman and the Angels. Wow, that's a nice hit. That is nice. It's one of those. All right. Last box. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see how that does. Let's 
see how that does. It looks dangerous. Looks dangerous, ladies and gentlemen. But Mookie bets over three. Stolen base and a walk for my fantasy team. Shinsu Chu, two for three. And a double. Okay, I like that. Lurie Garcia, two for four on the day. Two doubles, two RBIs. All right, I picked him up recently for stolen bases, but I'll take that too. Kyle Schorber, one for four. Justin Smoke, over two, but with a run and a walk. And I've got Carlos Carrasco on my fantasy team, who has given up, who gave up six earned runs in 0 0.2 innings. That's not good. Wait a second. No, never mind. A's. What about the A's? Are they playing tonight? I think A's are a lake. No, A's are playing right now. Bottom of the fifth. Rangers six. A's one. Wasn't I on the A's? I, don't I have financial interest in the A's? No, I do not. Oh, does A's have any hits in this break? I have no idea. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I honestly don't remember. Anyone else remember? I don't know, we'll have the video posted soon. And we've got tonight's starter for the Brewers, Corbin Burns. 50 out of 99. Goes to Jonathan Best and the Brew Crew. Facing my Dodgers. Some focus here. There we go. There's more Brewers hits in this break than Dodgers hits. I wonder if that means the Brewers are going to win tonight. And we've got Ramon Laureano. The uh, the man with the with the cannon for an arm. There's your A's hit right there. Tyler Fernandez with the Oakland Athletics. Yeah, I don't I don't think I've I've seen any Dodgers hits. They don't seem very plentiful in this mark. Where's my Dodger Joe Mojo? Jose Ramirez. Oh, that was dangerous. I shorted that one. That was dangerous. I, I better hope that's the last filler card. Got lucky there. Yeah, no more filler cards. Woo. Got lucky there. Lucky with that one. Look out for my uh, future coffee table book. Filler card art coming to a uh, high-end bookstore near you. Like one of those bookstores that sell those expensive art books. That kind of bookstore. Like 50, 60 bucks for like the, one of those like architecture bookshops. All right, the heirs to the throne, front, back, randomizer. Let's randomize that. Two and a two, four times, four the hard way. One, two, three, and fourth and final time. After four times, back cards will get those. So there you go. Thanks, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.